Ahem. <clears throat> My name is Joey, and today I'm gonna talk about things that we all can understand, that we all can relate to. Just so you know, the background music is Dreaming With Our Eyes Open, and it's by Whit Lowry. But, uh, anyways, a lot of you out there go through depression, go through bullying, especially cyberbullying. It could be Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, even Snapchat, believe it or not. Snapchat, yes. We all go through it. But, um, you gotta learn to fight it, man. Like, people are gonna bully you no matter what. People are gonna put you down no matter what. Even if you don't consider it just bullying. People on social medias will knock you down. I'm talking YouTube, Facebook, all sites. People will knock you down. But you gotta learn to rise up. You gotta learn to keep your head up. Especially when you think you're falling down. You gotta learn to keep your head up. Because, life isn't easy. Life's not perfect. It never was and it never will be. And it's never meant to be perfect. None of us are perfect, but each and every one of you out there is worth it. You're all worth it. Even sing, every single one of you out there is worth it. Ah. Sorry, I have this fly flying around in my room, and it's irritating me. Um, Try watching a movie on Netflix on your computer. Oh, man, that's that's another topic right there to talk about. But, oh, uh, yeah. When you get out, of, leave me up. Uh, I will kill you. Get. Go. Okay. Anyways, I'm going to try and talk, but uh, this thing here is going to irritate me. But each and every single one of you is worth it. A lot of you out there, none of us are perfect. Life isn't perfect. But each and every single one of you is worth it. And I'm going to keep saying that like it's on a repeat. You're worth it. <laughs> each and every single one of you are. I get made fun of every single day throughout high school. Sometimes my mic will not stay put. It will fall. But uh, if every single one of you out there, you're worth it. Okay, don't give up on life, don't commit suicide, don't hang yourself, shit yourself, stab yourself, don't do something stupid that you're going to regret later in life. You only live one life. When you die, you're not going to come back like it's a damn video game. This is not Call of Duty. This is not fucking Mario Brothers where you can jump and hit a frog, uh, not a frog, what do they call it? Uh, hit those turtles and then die and then come back to life and start all over, you know, from, from beginning to end. No, no, it just doesn't work like that. You only got one life. Live your life to the fullest. Live your life... Like it's holy, you know what I mean? I would add soundtrack in this from uh, Florida Georgia Line, holy, because I just said that, but I'd get a copyright strike for this. This here, I won't get a copyright strike for, because Will Lowry is awesome. He likes his music to be shared globally. Sick World does the same thing. Dennis, Dennis does the same thing. Dennis is kind of like, he reminds me of Eminem in a way. He looks like him, reminds me of him, but I don't want to compare him to that, though. And then there's Ivan B. These are rappers you should listen to, because their music will make you feel better in life. This song here is on a repeat. So it's going to repeat over and over again because I don't want to change the song, find a song, change the song, and then, like I don't have this all. And I'm just saying everything at the top of my head right now. I'm not writing this down, reading it off a notebook paper like I do with my raps. Okay, that's how I do it with rapping. Even though I can't rap or shit, but I can write some good-ass lyrics. I really can. I've been told I can. Um, but anyways... You're gonna go through some tough shit in life, but you gotta learn to suck it up. You gotta learn to man up, woman up, and I know this is hard for me to even say this to you. Don't get too emotional about what I just said. Just do it. Just do it. I'm not gonna be making videos as much on YouTube like I used to. I got a lot of things I gotta do. I'm 19 years old. I don't even drive. There's a lot of shit that's going on right now in my life. My life's not perfect. Never was, never will be. Nobody's life is. I don't care how pretty you are. I don't care how preppy and stuck up you are. You're not perfect. None of you are. We're not perfect. We're all the same. A lot of you out there probably are saying, yeah, I'm not just like you. You know, I got called a cheesy faggot the other day on one of my videos. Somebody sent me a message and said, hey, you're a cheesy faggot. Really? How, how's that an insult? Like, really? Like, people these days are stupid, man. But... This video is supposed to inspire you, it's supposed to help you. A lot of you out there need this. I need this myself. So I'm going to rewatch this when I need a kick up, a lift up. I'm going to watch it. But uh, yeah, just rise above, man. Just listen to positive music that will actually get you out there. Have good people in your life, good friends in your life. I got good friends in my life. I got like Tony, Cora, Carly. I've got so many great people in my life. I've got my friend Paige. I've got Tony. I don't even know if I said his name already. I've got Ryan. I got my friend Matt. These are people that I know. I got my friend Nathan James. I've got so many people. They're there for me. They understand me. You know, it's like they're a family. You know, we're all 
I want to say we're all family because that's going to sound really weird because a lot of us want to get out there and mate and have babies and have a family. You get my drift. But if they're really close to you and you know you're not going to try and get with them, etc., and have a happy life with them, then they're like family to you, I guess. I really don't consider people family to me unless you're related, but that's just the way it is. That's just the way I am. I don't consider you family unless you're actually related. But, um, yeah. Anyways, just keep your head up and I really hope this video actually helps you because... Trust me, life is not going to be easy. Being bullied in high school is not going to be easy. In middle school and elementary, I've been bullied since I was in fifth grade. I had this one guy, um, oh, what was his name? I can't remember his name. He was tall, like he was like six foot something, blonde hair, and he would pick me up with one hand. One hand, he would lift me up, like literally just lift me up, and it was like, he could literally hang me on the back of my door if he wanted to, if I had a hook on it. He could hang me. He, he just, that... Yeah, I got bullied like that. This guy would pick me up by the throat. Schools wouldn't do shit about it. Schools will not do shit about it nowadays. Our generation is fucked up. It always will be fucked up. Damn it. But, uh, yeah, just... Don't let what I'm saying bring you down. Let it raise you up. You know? Each and every single one of you have a purpose in life. You are alive for a reason. You are brought on this planet for a reason. You weren't just born for the fuck of it. You weren't just born so fucking God and life can like torment you and bring you down. You were born for a reason. Live your life to the fullest. Go to college. Um, or, or join the military or, or do whatever. It's your dream. You want to be a cop. You want to be a paramedic. You want to be a fire department person. Whatever. Uh, you know what I mean. Whatever you want to be in life, go for it and do it. You can't let people tell you you can't do something because you can do something. You can do anything in life. You just got to put your mind to it. You know what I mean? A lot of you out there need a friend, need somebody to listen to, to let you all your problems out to. So if you're watching this right now, I want you to leave a comment on this video. If it's on Facebook, if it's on YouTube, wherever, let me know your life story. I want to know your life story. You guys can find me on Facebook at Joey and then space and put the king. And, and my picture, I can't show what it looks like, but I'm wearing a hat. Not like this one exactly, but I'm wearing a hat. And it's like I'm facing down and I got my hand over, I got my hand over my mouth. And it's like black and white. You'll find it. And I'm wearing a hat and it says still standing on it. Kind of like my um, hoodie. I got this hoodie from a rapper. It goes by Sick World. Buy these hoodies if you still got them. Trust me, if you watch the music video for Still Standing, you'll understand that this guy here saves lives with his music, just like other artists will do it. Now, Eminem, I don't see his music saving lives. His music's great, but he ain't saving lives. Same with Wiz Khalifa. Same with a bunch of rappers. They're not saving lives with their music. They're not relating to us. They're not feeling us. They're not connecting with us. But Whit Lawry is, Dennis is, Ivan B is, so is Sick World. They all are. Those rappers are actually, some guy made fun of me for it, because I listen to these artists, because they're on a YouTube channel called Swaggy Tracks, and they're hip-hop and they're gay and shit. Just because you don't like their music doesn't mean the rest of this fucking world will like their music. They're not like you, okay? I like their music. If you don't like their music, then fuck you. That, that's just all I gotta say. I'm tired of showing respect to a lot of people that don't fucking deserve it. But everybody out there that I have not met, that is a total stranger, that I have not come across yet, no name, no nothing, I respect you. Until you show me a reason that I should not respect you. I'm sorry, that's just the way it is. If you respect me, I respect you. I'm a person that likes to have a smile on my face. Likes to get out there, be energetic. Likes to live life to the fullest. But it's hard to, you know, when you let everything build up and get to you. I have people make fun of me saying I'm an emotional little bitch. You know what? We all get emotional, fucker. We all get emotional, you fucking dick. That's how it is. We all get emotional. It's life. Call me ED, emotional disorder. Call me bipolar. Call me this. Call me that. But fuck you. I am the way I am, and I want to save this world. This world's falling apart, and I'm going to be the hero of it. If I have to join the military, if I've got to do something, I'm going to save this world. This world's falling apart, and this world needs a hero. And that's going to be me. I ain't no Batman. You know, I ain't no Superman. I'm none of those. But. I'm going to make a purpose in my life. And so are you. You are worth it. Each and every single one of you is worth it. I got to cut this video. Thanks for watching. And I I hope it actually does something with you. I, I hope all your dreams come true. Everything that you want in life actually happens.
And those of you that are in my life, those of you I've mentioned, those of you I haven't mentioned, you know who you are. You know that you've affected my life. Thanks for being in my life. You're not a weight on my shoulders. You're actually great people. I don't care what people have to say about you. You know, it's what I think about you. It's what I think, not what the rest of the world thinks about you. If I like you, I like you. If I like having you in my life, then I like that. That's just the way it's going to go. But, yeah. Thanks for watching. Have an awesome day. Have an awesome life. And just be you. Don't let anybody else bring you down. Just be you. Be the person that you are. Don't change for anybody. Don't be somebody else. Don't fake and be somebody else. Be yourself. And I'm going to exactly take these words and I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm going to be myself. That's just the way it is in life. you got to be yourself. All right? I know you guys can hardly see me. But yeah. Thanks for watching. And rock on. And I'm out, alright? You all have a wonderful life. And a great future. I'm out. Peace.